So the plane is responding as it should, except here. The data indicates the first officer is fighting against the go-around mode. He's pushing his control column to pitch the plane downwards. The plane can handle the go-around by itself. Exactly, but it seems they're fighting against the automated systems. The team looks at the pilot's personnel records. What were these guys thinking? They learn that Men Young, the pilot flying the plane, was made first officer just a year before the crash. He did 590 hours on you know, a variety of uh, smaller twin engine airplanes, all in a training environment. And now he's with a major airline in the right seat of a very large airplane. So that's pretty startling in itself. Captain Lo Shi had more than 8,000 flying hours during a 24-year career. But when investigators look further, they uncover a surprising detail. Not a lot of time in the Airbus. The captain flew Boeing 747s for most of his time at China Airlines, and only as a first officer. He was promoted to captain a year ago when he started flying the A300. With just over 1,300 flying hours, he was as new to the plane as his first officer. It's OK, just do it slowly. So did the pilots understand the flight systems well enough? Only the voice recorder can provide that answer. 